day. Oh my gosh, it was never ending. It's just so many things right after next and just everything went haywire. Day 27, I am writing at 10.47 p.m. Oh, it's so flippin' late. This day has just really been kicking my butt. Cause, oh yeah, guess what else happened? I dropped my phone in the bathtub. So that's currently soaking in rice. I don't have a phone right now. And my phone case is also my wallet. So driver's license, credit card, all of that fun, jazzy stuff got soaking wet. Everything is just getting ruined and oh, we're gonna write. It's now 10.58. I think I wasted almost 10 minutes. Oh, nothing goes as planned. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, oh I'm trying to find an affordable dress that could pass for ballet. Gosh, $120. <laughs> Ow. I think I have bug bites on my neck too, man. It's just, it's complain Diana today. You're getting complained, Diana. I'm sorry. I don't even know how I'm gonna write. I mean, I've been procrastinating doing this all day too. That's the thing. I just, I've lost all motivation. Or I've been doing it so much, so often, so frequently that I don't want to do it anymore. That's super bad. Oh my gosh, why every single time I try to scroll through the document, it's like, no, let's pop back up to page one. Why it did that to me three times? Come on. Oh yeah, that's right. I left off mid-sentence. It's 11.07. I think it was like, what, 58 when I actually started writing. So, six more minutes. Hey. I mean, I really wish I could write a whole lot longer. I really wish I could just whip out the rest of this chapter, but I just don't think it's feasible. I gotta go to bed because tomorrow I have a crazy day. I just realized something. So I have two characters. I have Jeffrey Nolan and Julia Allen. Jeffrey and Julia, are those names too close together? I'm really attached to the name Julia Allen, so if I had to change one, it would be Jeffrey. But what should I change them to? Should I do Jeffrey with a G instead of with a J? So it's like the same name but spelled differently, so it doesn't look as close. Let me try that and see what that looks like. So it would be the G off. Yeah, I think the Geoffrey <laughs> or Jeffrey works. I kind of want to keep on going. I think I actually got into a groove and I'm surprised. It's 11.26. Overshot my 15 minute mark. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I did. So I could stop now, but I do want to kind of keep on going. I did a bad thing. I got caught in online shopping. But I think I found my solution to my ballet costume thing. Yes, I got distracted. It's 12.04 and I'm not done writing yet. Technically, we're in day 28, but it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I still wrote a little bit for day 27, so it counts. Right? Right? It counts. I just want to finish. We're doing this daydream scene, right? We're... Love magic is like fluttering around her. Or is it fluttering? No, I think it's fluttering. Flutter. So I just want to finish writing that, but it's also late, man. Maybe I should go to bed. Ah, uh, okay. Things have been a struggle. I just. Ugh. I kept on getting distracted because I had this ballet thing on my mind. I think I found it. So, okay. I dealt with that. So it's 119. I did not write the whole time. I probably wrote half of that time. But it was definitely over 15 minutes. So let's do the word count and then I can hop into bed. It's so late. I did not intend on being this late. I only have one more scene to write until the end of chapter 5 though. So hey, that's pretty good. Total word count is 21,593. That's really good. Maybe tomorrow I can get to 22,000 words. It just depends on... I think instead of like, oh, I have 
all these things I need to do today and then writing challenge last. I think I need to do writing challenge first and then do all the things I need to do. I don't know. I also might sleep in a lot tomorrow, so we'll we'll see how tomorrow goes. Okay, so NaNoWriMo says zero days straight. It's just, ah, heartbroken. Should I say 27 days straight? Hopefully, once I put in, so I'm, instead of updating current word count, I'm going to be putting in a new stat where you can edit the date, and I'm hoping that would override the day straight. Oh, I can only do words this session, though. I don't really know. Okay, hold on. I have to do the math now. I'm going to highlight everything I wrote today. I just need to remember what spot I was at. 1,157. What? What? I wrote that much? Ha! Yes, okay. Now it says I wrote 27 days straight. Yeah. My best is 1,336, and that was on day 7. So I haven't topped day 7 yet. But I was close. I was only 200 words behind just topping my best. Wow, I was not expecting that. Was the lack of sleep worth it? I'm not going to get much sleep tonight. Either that, I'm going to get way too much sleep by sleeping in and wasting my day. Oh, and in case you were worried, because at the beginning of this video I said I dropped my phone in the bathtub. Well, it has uh, rice dust all over the speakers, but it works. And everything in my wallet doesn't feel super wet. The business card that I had in here is surprisingly, like, it's a little crinkly now on the edge, but it's fine. What got hit the most was actually my insurance card that is water damaged but it's still readable and so i got off really lucky well i will see you later today because it's you know 1 a.m i will see you later today in the day 28 video where i will write some more and maybe finish chapter five i know i was like really adamant about finishing chapter four and like oh my god i'm stuck on this chapter you know it's taking me just as long to write chapter five and i don't care at this point i'm like i'm just writing to get by to finish this writing challenge and then from there i will write on my own terms no matter what time of day you are watching this video have a good night's sleep because i i need it and of course there's the subscribe bubble of my face and the other boxes on the screen check those out i'm going to bed now i will Wake up when I wake up and do this all over again. Mm.